Hi everyone, welcome to Happy New Kids Learning. Today we are going to learn about even and odd numbers. A number belongs to two groups, either it's an even or an odd. Today, Mr. Durkee, help us to understand our concept of even and odd. Say hi to our friend. Mr. Durkee is ready to help us to discover the secrets of odd and even. Shall we start? So, what is this even and odd numbers and what are we looking for? And what is that keyword that tells us whether the number is odd or even? An even number can be grouped by 2. An odd number cannot be grouped by 2. It is all about the number 2. It is very confusing, right? Let me show you an example and you will be understanding it. Here is the easier number to do. Looking for the number 2, okay? We can group it in the group of 2 because it's a number 2. We got 2 duckies that makes the 2 as even. Now, this is odd. This ducky is all alone. It is not in the group of 2. This makes the number 1 as odd. Let's look back to the number 2. Our ducky has a friend now. It is not weird. It's not an odd. So, it is an even number. Here we have 3 duckies. Now, can we put number 3 in group of 2? Oh no, because third ducky is all alone. Top 2 has a friend, but the third one is all alone. So, this makes 3 as odd. Here we have 4 duckies. Now, we are looking for the group of 2. Now, we have 2 groups. That means 4 is even. Wow, 5 duckies. Look, 1 at the bottom doesn't have a friend. That is an odd. So, 5 is an odd number. Now, moving on, we have 6 duckies. That means each duck has a friend. 6 is even. Wow, here are 7 duckies. But, one ducky doesn't have a friend. Six of them have friends. One is all alone. So, seven makes it an odd. Number eight. Everyone has a friend. Yes, there is no one without a friend. So, eight is even. Now, moving on to the next number, nine. We spot one ducky without a friend. That means nine is an odd number. Moving on to the next number, ten. Now, you can tell, right? Is 10 even or odd? Yes, 10 is even because each of our ducky has its own friend. I'm going to teach you some important tricks that you can use in even and odd. Our first trick, all of the numbers alternate from odd to even and even to odd. I'm going to show you. Here we go. We have first 10 numbers and the trick was all the numbers alternate from odd to even. So, 1 is odd, 2 is even, 3 is odd, 4 is even, 5 is odd, 6 is even, 7 is odd, 8 is even, 9 is odd and 10 is even. The first trick says that all the numbers alternate from odd to even. And our second trick, with the numbers bigger than 10, we can see if it is odd or even at the end. With the numbers bigger than 10, we can see if it is odd or even at the end. To demonstrate that, let's play a small game called as odd or even. Our first number is 21. Is 21 even or odd? Yes, it's odd because the last number is 1. 1 is odd. So, 21 is odd. So, all the numbers that ends with 1 are odd. Let's look at 32. Is 32 even or odd? Yes, 32 is even because last number is 2 and 2 is even so 32 is even. Now let's look at 100. Is 100 even or odd? Yes, 100 is even because 0 is even. Hope you understood even and odd with me kids. Thank you.